Hello and welcome to Sony Ericsson Support. In this video, we'll have a look at how the menus and user interface works on your phone. When you first start your phone, the standby view is shown. At the top of the screen are five tabs that you can set up to have easy access to the things you use the most. Right now, I have tabs representing favorite contacts, the Twitter view, the flow view, the album view, and the shortcuts view. Swipe sideways to switch one tab at a time, or tap on the tab itself to quickly go to the tab you want. I'm switching to the Twitter tab by swiping from left to right. You can access any activity or application on your phone or change settings through the main menu. Press the menu button. Tap an icon once to open an application. For example, tap Messaging to work with text messages, MMS or email. Whenever you see a list like this, you first select the option you want and then tap again to open it. For example, to write a new message, select New Message, then open it by tapping again. To go back to the previous menu, tap Close. To quickly exit the application, open the Options menu and tap Exit. Whenever you choose to exit an application, it stops running and is removed from memory. You can also let the application keep running in the background. This is called multitasking and is useful, for example, if you want to quickly switch to another application and then quickly return to what you were doing. Right now, I've started typing a text message. Go back to the menu by pressing the menu button. Look at the messaging icon. In the top right corner is a small activity spinner indicating that this application is still running in the background. Long press the menu button to show a list of all running applications. Long press on an icon and either open the application or force it to exit. I'll choose Exit. Note that the application spinner is now gone because the application is no longer active. To maximize battery performance, make a habit of closing applications you aren't using. Before we finish, locate the application folder in the main menu. This is where you'll find some preloaded applications and any applications that you install on your phone. Thank you for taking the time to view this film. You'll find more information about your phone by visiting the VVAS or VVAS Pro support zones where you can improve your user experience.